Okay, how are we doing out there? First things first, my name is Kenneth Bird. I'm the creator of Illuminous 4K Screen Paint using Ambient Light Rejection. Technology gain times eight. Now, if you notice in our demonstrations, how you can make out all the interesting items I have here in my office slash gaming room, you can read and see everything in the environment that I have. Now, the reason why I like doing demonstrations because number one, in this particular environment, because yes, it's my gaming slash office room, but it also allows you to see that I can have my lights on and you can make out everything in the environment. There's nothing in here shadowed and darkness. One of the things I noticed when dealing with a light screen of gray or white, they have to be in the dark, especially if you're trying to show off contrast. That screen will always sit in the dark. It will never ever be able to do demonstrations in fully lit environments. Maybe ambient light controlled environments, not fully lit environments. Now, one of the things I told you about our technology, it has the ability to produce amazing white levels for a black screen compared it with other black screens even made a black screen paint that was online and painted it on and it came up very dark it came up very very dingy and as i said before one of the ingredients which has been disposed of i had to pack it in sand and take it down to a facility for disposal but one of the ingredients was extremely toxic it should have never ever uh been uh given as an advice to make any kind of screen paint with that particular item um, like I said, once it becomes airborne, it can be very, very toxic. All right, so but let's move on from there. Now, as I'm showing you, this is our wallpaper screens that are four feet by eight feet. We may have these in back order too, because I think we have about 20 left in our shopping cart. Pretty soon these will be on back order. And the manufacturer does not seem to have enough of this particular material to pass around. So it may be on back order for at least about two weeks to a month. So if you have the opportunity to get one of these wallpaper screens, I would suggest you do it now because once they go on back order, it may be a couple of weeks and it could be a month before we can actually get the surface again. All right, so let's go from there. Let's show you. I've done the demonstration using the 1100 lumen Sony projector doing it on the side by side versus the knockoff projector. Now we're just going to use the 43 at 1920 by 1200. Keep in mind, my projector is nowhere near 4K. It's a little bit above 1080p. The resolution, like I said, is 1920 by 1200. And as always, we do this in a fully lit environment to show you that you don't have to be in the dark in order to be able to enjoy an amazing picture from your projector. All right, so I'm gonna come over here and grab my controller that I have set up. I'm get this running through my PS4 system. And we are going to begin. And keep in mind, no calibrating the projector at all whatsoever needed.
Now keep in mind, some people want to show you really, really sharp, sharp detail. Keep in mind, you're not going to be able to see that. If you're sitting back seven, eight, or ten feet back from your screen, you're not going to see that. You see how beautiful those white levels are? Look at her skin tone. And one of the beautiful things I like about this black technology, it has the ability to be able to produce certain, uh, actually, um, levels of white. Notice her skin's in a different tone, the shirt's in a different tone. Look at the nails. And this is on an uncalibrated projector. This is on a projector that is only a little bit above 1080p, but 1920 by 1200. Still is within the 1080p category, but no 4K required. If you don't need it, you don't have to have it. And all the while, I'm doing the demonstration in a fully lit environment. Now, as I said, if you're watching demonstrations that are being done in the dark, then that's where you're going to be at, in the dark. Because the only way that screen is going to be able to produce an image, it has to be surrounded in darkness. Now, keep in mind, if our screens look this incredible on a projector that's not 4K, can you imagine it on 4K? Can you imagine if you did it, if I did, well, I've done demonstrations in the dark. So if it looks this incredible with the lights on, imagine what it looks like with the lights off. But with our technology, you have options. This is something a gray or white screen can never do. Now, see, our screens can produce high white levels. That's what they're designed to do. But keep in mind that this is something that a gray or white screen will never do. They will never attempt the star field demonstration. They have to do it in a dark environment. And even if they do it in a dark environment, I have proof that the screen is still going to come out gray in different shades of gray. Now, let me show you how high the white levels are, and if I can find the uh, demo sheets. I had a few sheets over here of gray. I don't know if I took them downstairs to the shop. I might have taken them downstairs to the shop already. But we'll do that for the next demonstration. We still have plenty of time. Tomorrow, we still have, I'm going to do some more demonstrations on these, uh, these uh, gray and um, these light gray screens. Like I said, anytime they do any form of contrast demonstration, it will always be done in the dark. Always.
we have so much inflammation in the body, and it comes out in illnesses. See how beautiful that looks. We a PS4 mount and PS4 controller, so that's why it takes me a little longer to get this done. I'm gonna see these demonstrations right here. I couldn't pull this off. Black 47, I don't know what that is, but that looks pretty cool. And the contrast levels looks pretty sick. How bright the beautiful the how beautiful the image is. Let me see if I have this one. Let's go to Well, we do all black screen saver, that'd be interesting too to do. Now, the reason why this is impossible for a gray or white screen to do because the background in any OLED demonstration is always black. It's not gray. So they have to do this with the lights out so they can give the illusion that the background is producing black when it isn't. It's actually producing gray.
I'm gonna pause right here for a minute, if I can. Good Lord, let me pause. Let's see if I can go back a farther. You want to talk about detail. Look at the individual hairs on the cat. This is without 4K. It's nothing impressive that you're going to be able to see individual hairs. Any 4K projector will give you that capability. That's one of the selling points of 4K, that the fact that it gives you a resolution so high. It's not the paint doing that, it's the projector that's doing that. Now, in our demonstrations here, I can show you that it's the screen that's producing the image, and I can show you how amazing the image is going to look on a projector that doesn't even have 4K. See, the beautiful thing about this technology is that you have to be stuck in the dark. Don't have to have a 4K projector. Don't have to calibrate the projector. Don't have to worry about the picture quality washing out or fading or any of that nonsense. And the beautiful thing about these particular screens is the fact that this is a wallpaper projection screen, which means it's already pre-coated. All you got to do is take it out of the box and stick it to your wall and you're done. That's it. I don't have to get close up on the screen just to show you how amazing the picture quality is. Look at this. You can see it right from here. You should be able to sit right here where I'm standing at, right where my projector's at, and be able to see the screen crystal clear. Look at the back of my area, my environment. You can see everything. All my Fallout toys, everything. And you don't have to worry, none of this is shrouded in darkness. You can see the corners. I can take my phone. Let me see if I get a little close. Show this real quick. Now look at this. You wanna talk about detail. Let's come over here and let's take my camera and let's put it right against the wall so I can show you the angle gain.
this is our black screen. That's why I said that. White screens, gray screens, it's old tradition. And you gotta be careful when you're dealing with some of these other black screens out there also, like I said, the white levels aren't high enough, contrast levels are too high, and the screen comes out dirty and muddy. How beautiful that cat looks. I mean, I know some people want to show you the individual hairs on an animal, but big deal. Doing it without a calibrated projector, and I'm doing it without 4K. Keep in mind, with this screen paint, you have the ability to convert anything you want into a high performance screen. You can paint this on your pre-existing projection, projection screens, motorized projection screens, manual projection screens, fixed frame screens. I got a screen downstairs that's around 200 inches. It was painted on smooth stucco. That just shows you right there what you can apply this stuff to. If you can think literally outside the box. Technology can be used with ultra short throw projectors. So if you have an ultra short throw projector, you don't have to have a special screen to use it. You want to use the technology outside? It can be used outside. We got dozens of demonstrations of the screens producing images outside with no problem. Like I said, what's the point of spending all this money for a good projector if you're not going to get the best you can get out of it? All right, with that being said, I got to go. Thank you all and God bless. I have this Street Fighter joint I want to do really quick. Let me see for a quick. I'm come out here a minute. Come out just a minute. I just want to see something real quick. Better experience for watching in 4K. We'll see. They don't have our technology. Now what you're seeing, when you're looking at black levels on this technology, you are seeing 100% real black levels. Not shades of gray, 100% black levels. But I want to pull up this other demonstration really quick. Let me see if I can figure out exactly what I was looking for. Oh.
love doing gaming on here. Turn the volume up. Just to show you how incredible gaming looks on this. Say this is the perfect gaming screen. Wallpaper screens are fantastic for gaming. There's no assembly, no no uh, put working with tools, none of that. Just take it out of the, take it out of the box, connect it to your wall, and you're done. That's it. Start gaming. Running off the PS4, looking amazing. Look at this. Alright, I hope you enjoyed the video demonstration. Thank you all for your time. I have to go and God bless.